All right, welcome back in for another video. Uh, so today we're going to be talking about the Eldar Combat Patrol box. So the Zoom, Doom, and Boom dominate every phase with the Combat Patrol Eldari. Uh, I don't know who makes the titles, but uh, they get me. They get me sometimes. So here is the brand new Combat Patrol for the Eldar. So you've got the Wind Riders, the New Guardians, uh, the old Farseer model, and the old Wraithlord. So the Wind Riders, I don't think these are new. These aren't new, are they? Uh, I was trying to look on the website at the like all the new things that have come out, the Guardians, the Dark Reapers, uh, the Warlocks, the different units. And I I don't think that these are new. I think that these are old. I was honestly trying to find out if they were. I know they're sold out on the web store as well, but I think that these are the old ones. I know that the Shining Spears were redone. Uh, but for the purposes of this, I'm going to like, we'll just go with, so they're Wind Riders. Uh, so it's interesting with this box because... With having one of the newer Guardian units, it's like, okay, well, you know, new Guardians. But it's the old Farseer model that I'd say most Farseer or most Eldar players have now. And then the old Wraithlord, which how many Wraithlords do you have? So in comparison with the old box, this is the old Star Collecting box. So you can see the same Farseer, Wraithguard, Wraithlord, and a Warwalker. Now... This was an interesting box because uh, it was a low model count start collecting. I believe it was the lowest model count for start collecting. And when you got this, it kind of leaned you more towards Iden, where they're using uh, Wraithguard as troops. Uh, but I, it, for people getting into Eldar, I thought it was a decent box if you grabbed this and a box of Guardians, right? Like you, you kind of wanted Dire Avengers. Like you wanted to get something else on top of this. This box, I think, is a better package for people to get started with however i think that the box should have been a unit of the new guardians great a unit of the new dark reapers instead of the bikes a unit of the new rangers instead of the wraith lord and then the new warlocks instead of the far steer so it was a start collecting with all new models in it to grab old players to to get this box as well and then for new players it's just i feel like having that force is kind of a more cohesive unit to start off again i haven't seen the whole new eldar codex yet uh maybe this is the perfect 500 point army but i think that the other one with the new models would have been a little bit more enticing uh and it's funny when you look at like the wanders of the stars where it was one of those boxes that they released with all new stuff that came with like the portrait uh, and the new codex, the dice, and it just came with everything. Where, like, if you so again, this wouldn't be in this box. It would be this, these models right here, plus the rangers. It's just some troops. Like, I, I, th I think that's a more enticing offer, at least from my standpoint, where it's like the new models as well. Because I know a lot of the start collectings, or sorry, the uh, combat patrols that they're now replacing the start collectings with, they kind of throw in one new model. And sometimes that's all you like the range will just get one new model and it's just more of an update. That's fine. But when you're getting a lot of new models, I think it's a better uh, offer to put them in these combat patrols. Because, uh, again, it'll get old players back into it by getting to start collecting or sorry, the combat patrol and the new codex. And for new players, it's, hey, there's a bunch of new models for you as well. Uh, let me know in the comments what you think of this new box. Uh, if you're an Eldar player, especially what you think, because I'm very interested to see if this is something that people, existing players are going to be picking up. Uh, I'll see everybody soon.